Um, wow. Well, what next for you? Um, because uh, there is, you've done a lot already, uh, both academically, both in terms of your military career, and you've got some other aspirations around that, local government, working for an MP. What does the future hold for you? I, well, I think going back to what I said before, but I have absolutely no shame in saying that I'd love to be an MP somewhere um, and, and, and eventually do that. But I am very aware that I am quite young and I've got four years as a local councillor where I can learn a lot from the people around me um, and hopefully do a lot for the community that I serve as well. So that is a priority at the moment, doing that, learning. Um, I'm not sure what's going to happen with my army career. Hopefully that progresses. And if it is the kind of combat medic route that I want to go down, there's again, there's an awful lot to learn there. Um, I think you said it earlier, but just taking every opportunity that I get, whether that's listening to people, whether that's engaging, going on courses, uh, upskilling myself in, in the reserves, um, traveling, um, or even just kind of learning things within my own party and, and from politicians on this side.